Well, of course, everybody's concerned whenever there's any kind of a spill on the river. And I did personally notice on, on Sunday, mo Sunday morning when I got up and washing my face and brushing my teeth, I, I smelled uh, petroleum and I tasted it, uh, light o odor of it, and thought, hmm, that's kind of strange. That's before I uh, really understood what was going on. And have that be there. That was there Saturday night. I think it was there. The American Queen was supposed to come, and we heard from them, and that's how we really knew that something had occurred on the river, because they were not allowed to navigate. And uh, so the, they were supposed to stop and, uh, with about 250 passengers on board, and that didn't happen. Theoretically, for their husbands to be coming, you know, and then it, it, I, you know, it's a widow's walk, I guess. We'll come in and stay the, you know, in the, around, but Mardi Gras, a lot of it's a concern. We're, we're mostly concerned because we haven't had accidents like this in this area. But they've recently established an anchorage here, uh, and we're concerned that the that the corridor that the vessels are having to pass through now, with barge fleeting going on on both sides of the river, and now an anchorage established here, uh, just below a severe curve in the river, is causing a navigation could be causing a navigational hazard, and this may be the beginning of more problems.